I saw this, you know, the, the bottom of the coffee, and it all of a sudden reminded me a story uh, of my aunt. So my aunt, she grew up in Jerusalem, way, way back. She had a birthday, I think it was her 19th birthday or 18th birthday, and her sister, my other aunt, want to give her a present and she took her to a fortune teller to an Arab fortune teller in Jaffa I don't know how they went there with donkeys or whatever bass or whatever but anyway she get to Jaffa that's the story and it's a, like a family story they went to Jaffa and this I think he was blind I'm not sure how he read call he touch it or whatever or touch hair or whatever and he told her you're gonna marry uh, an English soldier, a British soldier, and you're gonna have an uneven number of boys, only boys. That's what the, the fortune teller told her. They get out of the meeting, and my aunt was like, such a bullshit. She was back then fighting the British, she was in the resistance. So it's like saying, you know, I, I don't know, Bush son is gonna marry an Al Qaeda. Uh, activist well that's maybe not so far-fetched but you know it doesn't look right two weeks later a knock on the door a guy came to deliver a package actually he was mistaken by the address he was supposed to go up but she opened the door and the guy looked at her and boom and he was a Jewish guy but he was working for the British at the time for the British Army or something and he had uniform and they met and they got married and first boy another boy and, another, and she at that point forget about it about the the fortune teller and when she was like over 40 and you know had a uh, you know long, long hours long career long that she had an unplanned un, uh, pregnancy and she and her husband said, like, that's enough, like, you're too old, like, let's, let's go to the hospital and, and do an abortion. And all of a sudden, when she's sitting, waiting for the doctor to come, all of a sudden, she reminds that the story, she thinks, oh my God, if I'm doing the abortion now, it means that I will need to lose one of my kids. And the one kid was like, whatever, older in the army or whatever, she got scared. With the gun, she left the, the hospital and she have five boys now man but he was right on the money and this was told to me by my dad who was like the last person to kind of like fortune tell on that but that's apparently was a true story so if you ever doubt that fortune teller works it works in some cases in my family it works <laughs>